over here. On the move. Don't want to keep her too far ahead. Ah, bastard. Got minimum damage with two weapons. Oh, he's gonna do damage to you. Oh, six damage. Shit, you still have your full armor. Come on, panic. Panic. Mm. Okay, that was one extra. Maybe it, maybe it has an ability to power up or something. So I should give this to Quint or Brad as they are the lowest. Oh, well, they're actually two enemies. 74. Oh, we got targets on one. Fine, here's what you're gonna do. I right, got to see the sectopod. So you're just gonna make a little move over here. I'm trusting you here. We already have sights on the area, so you won't get hurt. And you gotta kill. I got it, right? Yes, yes you did. I made your personality twitch and it fits you perfectly. This one needs to go to Quarant. Currently can't see it. It'll be by Julian, technically armor. Sure thing. Definitely. Not armor, it's cover. Whatever. 97. Come on. Should hit. Minimum. Oh, Brad has to minimum. Not even close. What? A 3% chance? That is the worst one yet. I think you have to step away from the enemy to have decent shots on him. The thing is, he's not living. This unit is relatively I wanted you to heal yourself this turn, but that's happening here. It went down. I thought being too close to him reduced it. Whatever. Take the shot. Nothing else to Are you sure this weapon was properly assembled? I'll need to reload soon. This is annoying. Six. You have a minimum. I should have given the minimum to Quint. Not to Brad, but whatever. Finally. Whatever. It's your kill. You got it. Well, that was frustrating. Who's score? You're gonna conceal. Going dark. And you'll take this item. Time to motor. Now we're two cores and some more data cache. I have the asset. Back in. And I don't really want to advance too far. So everyone gets a chance to move, so we'll just We see it now. No, I don't want to somehow get flanked by this thing. We'll send you out this way. Heading to that location. Nothing. Hopefully, this isn't too far ahead. Moving on target location. Nothing. Okay. So reload and move, people. I didn't look how much it heals you by, but you took a nasty hit. Ooh, plus six, okay. Is it always plus six? Is it like as good as he didn't really say? You will have to reload next turn. Physical exertion avoid. I don't think anyone has the free reloads on, so this is fine. You say so. And 
you'd think she'd be able to see it if it was right here, so... Put you right here. I can handle that. Nothing. Then Overwatch. Ooh, there it is. Shit. Oh, they know we're here now. Hey, we should hit the sectopod. Okay, I already took down a mech, and the sectopod is the only other robotic enemy I knew about, so we will be using that grenade this turn if possible. Take a look at my sniper real quick. 100. And you'll be able to do massive damage. Ah, oh, that's not a one time thing, it just has a cooldown. 100. The dead eye. Ah, oh, but it's not a hundred. I got a crazy thought. Could I go over here? Anywhere else? No? Where are... How much can you do with a normal shot? on? You can hit him and... I think he has seven. Might kill him. It's a Lancer. I'll have to get someone else up here to help you. This would guarantee kill if you hit him. Or just do massive amount of damage to him. Let's have everyone else move around first. We were not close enough to do that. Oh, I think that technically works. All right, we'll move Curtis and do that. Wait, uh, does anyone else have a rocket? Julian does. With a bigger radius, but they are close enough for Curtis to hit, so he will be the one to launch. And Brad already used his. Let's get Curtis out there. Maybe I... If I move Brad, he can take that spot. Well, Brad might just be the one going after the Lancer. Or at least one of the ones going after the Lancer. 60. I'll come back to you. Now Curtis can take this spot. Tired of waiting around. <laughs> Suckers. Launching. Now I don't even have to use dead eye on the other guy. I just gotta hit him with someone else. Okay, we may have to use your move ability. Oh, he's pretty far back. He might not be a threat this turn. Unless I put someone too close to him, that is. Oh. Hmm, someone in there. If I don't like it, I'll have you move. I could attempt hacking. Just a thought. Lancers do have guns, so you might still shoot. Oh, right. Said I would try this. That doesn't look like it would do very much. Damage and disorient mechanical units. Six. Maybe it just has too much health? No, that would do way more, apparently. Why is the damage so bad? Why does it like, look like nothing will happen? Julian can also do something. Julian could use his. I would kill the shield bearer, so I wouldn't have to worry about him anymore. I wonder if I could hit these two instead. Have Julian move a little closer. Should I double check that for you? I remember, I don't know what's left after this. But I could hit these two. Uh, if I'm gonna hit them, I'm just gonna focus on them. Maybe I'll even destroy the landscape for that guy. So, here we go. He's down and I have his corpse. That leaves four people. Oh, what? He gets to step back or something? Weak. Much better odds. I need to get a free action on him somehow. You should be able to do it. Can Brad at least target the guy? Yes, he can, which means Brad can kill the guy. Let's at least look at your hacking odds. 
I doubt they're going to be high enough, but let's just see. Why, why was he over there? Oh, right, because you jumped. Oh, yeah. No. I brought this grenade on for a reason. Ideally, it'll hurt you more than what I see. So here goes nothing. Yeah, there we go. Maybe, maybe it shows that because if you like throw it at a normal enemy, it wouldn't really do the damage, but it doesn't know until after you hit it or something. What did, what did that say? Hack defense dec- Oh, I could- It'd be easier to hack now that I threw that grenade at it. My character doesn't need another kill, so let's just damage the hell out of it. Yeah, no. We got Brad to take care of that guy. Boom! It's like having Adam's gun around. So you do. So, so it's got like eight health left. Uh, if I need to, and I might have to. Oh wait, no, I'm down to two. I will have to use Ayumi if I want to kill this thing now. Ninety-eight percent. How close could I get before we see her? I could get a. Little, you've already got decent odds. But nope, I can't get on the building I was going to get her on. Yeah, seems like a waste to have used it. You know, this will actually guarantee you killing it. Going up. I should have saved her conceal. But yeah, I'm gonna make sure this thing dies this turn. So before I do that, let's make sure Chicken Heart actually kills his turret. Should. Be a Good job. Check it before you get too close. I prefer this personality on you. You have a really good crit thing. Really good crit odd. 60% crit odd. But it's already gonna break your cover, so what's the matter? You get you got it. Meet over metal. One shot again. Position compromised. Uh yeah. Alrighty. Discussed how that was a bad idea to use it too soon. Ah, this mission's going very, very well. And I imagine they're gonna send in a lot of reinforcements once I actually get to the device. Let's see the doors over there. You could drop down through. This technically has cover, so sure. Moving to 